Hey guys, Aquatic Aesthetics, and we have an unboxing again today. So let's take a look, see what we got. Ah, these guys are brand new. A little on the small side we'll get them from above these are Imperial Ranger Placos uh, I will get the L number later on but these guys are stunningly beautiful get up to be a decent size too Always like bringing in the new Placos. This one we've got Black Phantom Tetras holding back most of their color right now. They have a beautiful dominant dorsal fin. And these are Gold Honey Garamis. And we have Cardinal Tetras. Some color coming through on them, not much at all. We have assorted fancy dwarf Garamis. Good color to them. They always come up colored pretty well. Ooh, the stone catfish are back. We brought in some of these a couple weeks ago and they took those wings they got and flew right out of the tank, right into the bags. There you go. Great shot of them. I love these little guys. They are definitely a nano cat. Maybe an inch, inch and a quarter. Great nano cat to have. And they go pretty quick, like I said. Let's continue on with fresh water. Algae eating a mono shrimp. These guys will tear through some algae for you. They love the filament algae. Great cleaner to have in a planted tank. As long as you don't have any predators that'll eat them. And this one we've got Herbrocious Pygmy Corydoras. These guys just stunning little quarries. They get upwards of about the size of a normal quarry you'd buy in the store, the size of it when you buy it. So probably about three quarter to one inch on them. Another great nano bottom feeder. Oh, let's get this guy from above. We've got a crawfish here. This is a platinum white. Trying to pinch my finger through the bag. I like his spunk already. Okay. We have guppy females. These are assorted deltas. Oh, 
have more of the Herbrocious Pygmies. The Corridors. And these guys big. Ah. The polka Dot Pictus Catfish. These are great little friendly cats to have. They just never stop moving. Literally never stop moving. Okay, one more box of fresh and we'll go look at what little bit of salt there is. We have some gold veil angelfish. Nice looking. Rainbow sharks. Uh, good little fish to just constantly run around your tank and harass your other fish when they get older. This is a Goldvale Angel, regular. Looks like they split our order through a few bags. We have a Betta. This is a Black Samurai Placat. Nice looks to him. have another better this is galaxy koi I believe yes it is beautiful colors and we've got my camera going nuts we have a sunshine better These are Pandagara's wonderful daytime algae eater. They can certainly replace the role of a Placo. And boy, do they do best in a school though. A little bit of a pricey fish to have a school of them, but you'll be so happy if you do it. Boy, there's something in there real active. I guess these are going to be gold nuggets. Uh, yep, that's what they are. Gold nugget placos. I can't ever get a good bag shot on a placo. There's a decent one. Okay. Horse face loach. These guys are a very, a very interesting loach. They can dive under the sand, not only dive under the sand, they can swim through the sand. You'll see them go down in one corner of the tank and come up on the other. Fascinating fish. Okay, that is all of fresh. Like I said, I just have a couple special order here for salt and just a few for the tanks. Yeah. Oh, he's hiding from me. This is a Blue hippo, regal blue hippo tang. They got them, looks like triple bagged. So it'd be kind of hard to see them. Uh, 
And we have a pearly jawfish. I should have three of those guys on this order. The regal tang was a special order. The pearlies are not. There's one very, very, very active. He's punching the side of the bag as I pulled him out. These are some Recordia mushrooms. This is a gold coral banded shrimp. Great little cleaner to have. Keep a close eye on them. Some of them can get pretty mean to your fish. Another pearly jawfish, and now you can see exactly why you need a tank lid for these guys. They are jumpers, but they're great for your tank. Let's see, show you this guy in the bag while he's kind of opened up. If it'll show it. These are feather dusters. It's a cluster. It's a special order. Who knows? Maybe it'll still be open when we pull it out. Oh, no. It pulled back in. There's one of them open. A couple of them. And what it is is a cluster of feather duster worms. And the last one, another coral banded shrimp. And he is m missing a claw. That is one I will have to talk to the distributor about. Who may just be watching this video, so expecting my call. All right, guys. And that's an empty box and uh, these are now full so i got to get these put up and we will see you guys at the store